This is Woodruff High School, 1955-1956. These are the sounds that echoed through the halls from September to June, the sounds that we remember so well. Soon after school opened in September, the Warriors played their first football game of the year. Little did anyone realize then that this was to be the greatest football season ever recorded in Woodruff history. Second down and still 10, the ball on Manuel's 35, Woodruff's ball, 20 seconds remain in the first half, 7-0 the Warriors lead. Intercepted pass and a 16-yard run by Zarley and given Woodruff the touchdown. There is the give to Sullivan, finds a hole, 25, at the 20, the 10, down on about the manual and out of bounds at about the eight yard line with 12 seconds remaining. The 1956 homecoming featured one of the finest selections of stunt shows ever presented on the Woodruff stage. Leading the field was the junior class's rendition of It's a Bonnie Sure Thing. Drums in my heart are drumming, I hear the way At the conclusion of the football season, the Warriors were honored in a victory assembly by the entire Peoria area for their undefeated and untied record. We knew our boys would do it, and it come through, and we have the first time in our school's history undefeated and untied football team. And that is really something. Let's hear from you now. This is unquestionably, this Woodruff High School football team of this year is unquestionably one of the finest high school teams I've ever seen in operation. I can't say too much about this Woodruff team. They certainly were a fine football club this past season. Having formerly been a football and basketball official, I like to contact the men that work the ball games because I think they're pretty close to the situation. And to the man, I got nothing but complimentary remarks about the Woodruff team as a whole, the Woodruff players as individuals, and the fine coaching job that was turned in by the men that guide the ball club. And I think that's just about as high a compliment as you can get. For the Christmas season, we remember the annual student Christmas assembly and the vocal music department's cantata entitled Rose of Christmas. I'm going to tell you my favorite Christmas story, all about the littlest angel. 
Once upon a time, many years ago, as time is calculated by man, but only yesterday in the celestial calendar of heaven, there was in paradise a most miserable, thoroughly unhappy, and utterly dejected cherub who is known throughout heaven as the littlest angel. After New Year's, classes resumed, and the basketball season moved into full swing. Friday afternoons featured pep assemblies. Sounds like these followed a few hours later. And it's off the rim, no good. Fought for control by Wayne Dimmons for Woodruff. The central team never dreamed of the Woodruff Warriors being this rough tonight. Higgs with the ball now, holding high above his head. Gets back over to sophomore John Fowler. Fowler back over to Higgs. Higgs, one-handed shot, it's up, it's no good. Garrison underneath, the basket drops through. I don't know whether it'll count or not. It should, the basket does count. The winter band concert provided some of the finest musical entertainment of the year. Included in their performance was a stirring march entitled The Klaxon. Entertainment for dances and other school programs was furnished by talent from the student body. Receiving top billing were the junior misses, a girls' quartet whom we remember for Dungaree Doll. Dungaree Doll, Dungaree Doll, paint my initials on your jeans so everyone in town will know we go around. Together, together, we'll always be together. Dungaree Doll, I'm your Dungaree Doll. Paste your picture on my sleeve so everyone can see that you belong to me forever, forever, forever. I want to wear your orange sweater, the beat up sweater with the high school letter. Gonna make a chain of paper clips and chain us together while you kiss my lips. Dungaree doll, dungaree doll. Promise you I never will fall for any other guy. Don't you know that I'm your dungaree, dungaree doll? Well, do I want to wear your orange sweater, do the beat up sweater with the high school letter. Do Gonna make a chain of paper clap and chain us together while you kiss my lips. Oh, dungaree doll, dungaree doll. Promise you I never will fall for any 
other guy. Don't you know that I'm your dungaree, dungaree, dungaree doll? Dungaree, 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 dungaree doll. In April, campaigns were held and the student body elected their president and vice president for the coming year. Holding office in 1956-57 will be President Dixie Boardman and Vice President Bill Cannell. This is my candidate, Dixie Boardman. Thank you very much. First of all, I'd like to say that it's been a real honor being a candidate for president of this school. Campaigning has been a lot of fun and a lot of hard work, but yet I'd like to thank everyone who's helped me and I really appreciate it. Then second, I'd like to say that I've always felt that the president of the school was one of the highest honors that Woodruff has to offer. I realize the job is a hard one, but if elected, I would work to the very best of my ability to carry out the wishes of you, the students, and the faculty. This afternoon, each one of you have a chance to vote for the president of the school. Think it over carefully and vote for the candidate of your choice. Thank you. This year has been a notable one in many respects. Our largest enrollment to date of 1,704 pupils was attained, and our AKW Alumni Association celebrated its 50th or golden anniversary, 1906 to 1956. Our students, through their abilities, school spirit, and hard work, aided by the excellent instruction of our faculty members, brought outstanding recognition and a number of national, state, and local awards to our school. Our June graduating class of 358 members will be one of the largest we have ever graduated. We congratulate them and extend best wishes for their happiness and success in later life. With commencement exercises in June, another year ends and another class graduates. Ahead lies the world for each to make his way, and behind lie the lasting memories of Woodruff High School. <laughs>